happy. The fact that I was able to make money, you guys all say hi to Elise, give her some love. Um, the fact that I was able to be part of something where I could build and really there was no glass ceiling. Like think about that guys, being part of something where there's no glass ceiling and teaching or if you're in uh, maybe, you know, I can think of a million different careers, but like maybe you're in um, law enforcement or a doctor. I mean, there's always a ceiling, right? You can move up and you might even be able to get more education and move up, but there's always at some point a glass ceiling. And so to be part of something where there wasn't a glass ceiling was intriguing to me. But the most interesting thing that happened for me was as I was selling this jewelry and having a great success, there were three things that I didn't like. One was other people weren't having the same success as me. And it really drug me down because my heart and my passion is to help others. And if they can't have the same success that I'm having, then it's hard for me to believe that it's possible. Mm. And like maybe I did just get lucky, which there's no such thing as that in this business, but that was what I was thinking in my mind. Second was I didn't like that I had to be gone from my family so much. And last but not least was the fact that it wasn't residual. And when I first jumped into direct sales party planning, I didn't know what residual meant. So I'm gonna touch on that really quick and then I'm gonna pass it over to them. But residual really means is that every single month you have people that are reordering with you because they love the product. Mm -hmm. They find value in it. They want to continue to do it. And so because of that, it's a residual income that builds up over time. So mm -hmm. you see it happen every single month. Your numbers continue to increase. Well, that wouldn't happen with the jewelry, right? So I found a product that I was super passionate about. But the best part beyond even that is that it really is something that people are finding value in and they love, and that brings me fulfillment, mm -hmm. and it makes it so easy for me to talk about with people because I know it's going to help them. I know it's a product that's going to work. I don't have to try to get them to leave their home every single week to do parties. I know that they can join me and really work this business cloud-based. So they can work it from their home, they can work it from their iPad, their laptop, their phone. Yes, we do love to get together with people like we did this weekend, and that's just to fill each other's cups up, learn about what the product's doing for others, and become better better people, better promoters, better at what we do. Um, but they're not the kind of things that you have to do in order to make money and be successful in this business. And that is what makes us unique. And so there are a lot of other things um, that we're gonna be covering today that were things that we just kind of talked about over the last couple of days yeah. of like, wow, we are so blessed to be part of this. Yeah, go ahead. Um, but I actually have to go help somebody on a call. So I will be popping in and out of this. Okay. But I'm excited for you guys to hear from everybody else. Yay. So we are really, I've got two live streams going here and we wanted to come on here today because you know we were sitting here chatting with our leaders yesterday and realize and all and a few of us have mm -hmm. these ex prior experiences in network marketing or direct sales and what we wanted to do is come on here with you all and share with you from our experience and we're going in we're going deep here we're gonna really share like what experiences we have had in the past that really make network marketing number one business opportunity out there and why is LaBelle? So bottom line is it is free for you to join. Every other business that I was part of had a startup cost. Whether that was, um, I think the most I paid was two sixty nine dollars just to enroll and then I needed to pay a yearly marketing fee. Now this is something that I think people who don't have any prior experience just take for granted in LaBelle because you guys, every other company out there charges you a fee just to be part of the company. They're making mm -hmm. money simply off of the enrollment fee yep. that you are signing up for, that your customers have to pay, that you as a promoter have to pay for those other companies. We don't charge that in this company. Mm -hmm. And that is something you may not know if you haven't been a part of network marketing before. So the other thing, so Carmel and I, we did jewelry together at Stell and Dot. And Yes, the product was great, but they were the ones that were, they charged a big enrollment fee. They had the samples you had to purchase mm -hmm. probably about every three months. How much would you say you invested in samples? Well, we didn't have a lot of money back then, but I would probably s under 800. And that's only like a few pieces of jewelry. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I did 2,500 a year. Yeah. Easy. Yeah. Ooh. At least. <laughs> wow. So, we, because you had to have the, the product on the table at the trunk shows, right? Mm -hmm. um, however, at the end of the day, you were only making 25 to 30% of your sales. And so you had to either do a lot of parties or you had to sponsor a lot of people. Mm -hmm. And the other issue was, now take note of this, because if you have experience in network marketing or you're looking at joining network marketing, what I, wanted, what I want you to grasp is the compensation plan 
and the one that I'm going to speak to is the one that we're part of, and that is it, it's a volume based mm -hmm. plan. You get paid based on your volume, not based on the number of ranks that you have personally sponsored. Right. Now, why is this important? I'll tell you because if you don't have those ranks in place from the people that you've sponsored, then guess what? You don't get paid as that rank, but yet you're still doing the same um, leadership roles and responsibilities, but you're not bringing in the money at that rank. So do you guys see how important that is to consider a volume based, or I wouldn't say that's my own term. How do we say it? It's, rel it's reliant on your volume versus reliant on the ranks. Can I say mm -hmm. one thing about that really yeah. quick? The thing that, that has changed the way that I look at network marketing direct sales, being in a company that is volume based, for example, mm -hmm. like if I wanna hit a rank, it's just based on the volume, not on other people hitting ranks underneath me. Mm -hmm. The reason that has been so freeing for me personally yeah. is because I'm not trying to drag other people right. or force them to hit a level that they're not really interested in hitting. Or, this is the other thing that happens in these situations, you'll have people who will sponsor somebody and put them yes. there. Speak to that, Andrea. Yeah. Very much so. So I came from Isogenics, um, and I, I enjoyed the products. But what got me as a single mom that got me was, again, I had the enrollment fee, mm -hmm. um, which I, at the time was brand new for me. I didn't think it was a big deal. Okay, one time. It's like going to Costco. I'm going to pay a fee to get that discount. Mm -hmm. I got that, right? So I thought. Yeah. But what got me was the fact that there were a lot of things that were going on behind the scenes mm -hmm. that I had no idea was going on until after the fact and the more I got into it. Um, and that disturbed me because that's not how I was raised. Um, and so I have found myself hard putting my head on my pillow at night of knowing things that were going on that they didn't know about. Meaning that Meaning like were... if I spoke to someone and they thought, okay, well, yes, you know, I've, I've talked to this person, but actually they're not the person that they're signed up underneath. They found out they've been signed up underneath somebody mm -hmm. else mm -hmm. and they had no clue. Right. Um, and I just do not think that that is right in any way, shape or form. Mm -hmm. um, so I had a really hard time with that because I had several come to me about that. Um, and I did, I spoke to my, my dad about it and my dad said, well, it's not how I raised you. Right. And yeah. he's like, it's, it's just, it's not right. He was like, if you think you're supposed to be doing something, that's what should happen. So it was out of integrity. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Do you think 100%. it was against their compliance policies, but people were doing it anyway? Absolutely. Oh, but it was to benefit, <laughs> but I will tell you, but it was to benefit themselves. Yes. Right. It right. was to benefit themselves. Yes. It had nothing to do with actually helping that person right. feel better mm -hmm. and to feel good or to become financially free. It was what could it do to help them mm -hmm. pad their pocket. And mm -hmm. I, that's hard to say mm -hmm. because a lot of people didn't want to admit that, no. but that was the underlying why mm -hmm. they done it. Mm -hmm. And that wasn't me. Yeah. I was like, ooh, can't do that. Yeah. No, no, no. Carmel, tell us about your experience in your prior <laughs> business um, and the hoops you had to jump through because really, a lot of these companies, I will be honest with you all, we've collectively been part of enough companies here. They are smoke and mirrors. Mm. They mislead you. Uh, the, <laughs> even the people that are enrolling you are going to mislead you. We oh, see it again and yes. again and again. And we've even had some people fall prey to that, that mm -hmm. have been part of Lavelle. And I hate to say it, they walk away from their check thinking that the grass is greener and then they get there and it's not. And they end up coming back starting from zero because they have loved what they built here and they didn't have the ability to compare what how incredible the opportunity was. Mm -hmm. So t speak to them about your experience about the smoke and mirrors and the jumping through the hoops because you have experience with that. <laughs> so you're speaking of ranks? Yeah, like, ranks okay, so or how people buy product to right. get a rank, to get paid, like, yes, you know. So, <laughs> When speaking about the someone having a specific rank under me in order to hit mm -hmm. uh, the next rank was always a challenge for me in the previous company that we were at. I would hit it once, yeah, and then because I didn't have yeah, another yeah. person that was doing what they were supposed to be doing for me to get the rank, but I was working my tail off, right? Then I wouldn't get that rank. So that was really frustrating mm -hmm. to me, but. What I love about what we do here is mm -hmm. the fact that it does change people's lives, right? It Thank does you. change people's lives 
And that's what we're specifically working towards. And while we're helping other people change people's lives yeah. and not worried about the rank or the check, mm -hmm. it, in abundance it will come. Mm -hmm. And the, the heartfelt messages of gratitude mm -hmm. are what truly solidify why I focus on the individual only in order to yes. see the other things fall into place. Absolutely. Yeah. Because so. the conversations are not about, you know, oh, well, I did this and this is what it, I done. It, did, it has nothing to do with me. Right. It's all about why did you reach out to me? How can right. I help you? Right. Yeah. Physically, right. financially. And I'm there to support. We're all there to support that for them, mm -hmm. which in turn then abundantly helps us get, you know, higher, but not because of we're being... Um, selfish right right we're or not being selfish or it's... scamming the system right right, right. <laughs> so one thing to consider because there's a lot of people on here that are watching this that maybe you aren't with a network marketing right. or a sales company with right now or maybe you're with one you're just not sure if it's the right one for you whatever what I really want to say is first of all there are amazing products out there in this industry right I am one of those people who absolutely loves and is passionate about a few different companies out there right now like I use essential oils I have for 10 years Mm -hmm. um, I use a certain face care line I did for five years. I used um, certain, you know, um, cleaning products, and I still use some of those companies. Um, and I use their products because they have amazing products. But you don't just jump to a company because you love the product. And I'm going to speak to this because mm -hmm. I really want you guys to hear what I'm saying, which is make sure you understand what your yearly fees are, like they were talking about. Mm -hmm. What comes out of your pocket every year? What do you have to do in order to make money off of your team, off of your customers? Mm -hmm. What do they have to do? Does the company line up morally and ethically with what you believe? Mm -hmm. What is their five-year plan? What other products do they have that enrich and provide for people's lives? Okay. And so when I decided to put my name with this company, the biggest thing was there were other products out there that I did love. This one did make a huge impact on Ryan and I and our health and what we, and, and it has mm -hmm. continuously for the last four and a half years. But it was also the fact that when I dove into the company, there was no yearly fee, no right. website fee, no stocking of inventory. People went directly to my website to order. Um, there was an opportunity for people to earn residual income. There was an opportunity where once you hit the highest rank, you could continue to grow, but it's not like you somehow um, sit back and do nothing mm -hmm. and just collect on your on your team. It's also that there's no glass ceiling. Like right. once you hit the top of the conversation, then you can continue though to go on and um, get paid that great commission. The commission goes down deep. It's yep. not two different things that I'm having to balance all the time. My team, um, I can build it across as many legs as I want. We have waiting room. Where in the first 60 days, I can move somebody to somebody else's team to help them hit a rank. Which... That's huge. I'll let you talk about that. Well, and I was going to say, our waiting room is a unique opportunity. And I believe it's really, really important to understand this, you all. Cloud-based business mm -hmm. model has created the opportunity to have this incredible waiting room opportunity. Cloud-based, first and foremost, means that we do not have a corporate headquarters, Okay. I'm thinking of a place in my head, a, two, a couple of different ones. I'm not <laughs> gonna name the names. <laughs> Actually, many, probably yeah. all of them. Um, they have multi-million dollar corporate headquarter slash campuses slash hospital slash you name it, university. They have different names for these places. And you, like, you drive past them and they have this elaborate, like probably the grounds alone cost millions of dollars, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you might be ooh, feel ooh and ah, but where does that money come from to build all that? Mm -hmm. Where does the money come from for the overhead to run all of that, to that cool hurts. the building, to light, you know, the power for the employees that are in the building, the, the cleaning staff, the whole nine yards, you all. That comes out of the consultant or the reps' mm -hmm. paychecks. Mm -hmm. It is built into their compensation plan. It is part of why they have an enrollment fee, okay? Mm -hmm. We are cloud-based, meaning our CEOs work and live from home, our support staff work and live from home. Mm -hmm. You know, we don't have a multi-million dollar corporate o um, headquarters with incredible overhead every year that's cutting into the rep's paychecks. Mm -hmm. Also, our founders are saying, why would we charge you to represent our product, right? Yep. 
It doesn't make sense. Mm -hmm. So there's no fee there, right? Okay. And so basically, the reason our waiting room plan opportunity is available is because we're cloud-based. They can afford to pay that out. Mm -hmm. Because what it does is you take money, or you, sorry, you take um, your new promoters and you can drive the volume down into di different levels on your team, meaning that person can rank up because you've assisted them in creating more mm -hmm. volume in that organization. Guess what? They earn a unilevel check as a result. You keep earning a unilevel check too. Yep. That person didn't sponsor these people that you placed, but the volume creates even more income for everyone. Now, do you see how incredible this is? Yep. And it's all because we are cloud-based. And there's not one person at the top that gets everything. Mm -hmm. And then you got your little working bees right. down here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's what I loved about this, <laughs> that I knew that the work that I put into it and what each individual yeah. underneath it, that they knew that the work and the time and the effort they put into it, yeah, they actually see that in return. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. And it's not about, mm -hmm. okay, you're getting it up here, but I'm getting nothing down here. Right. Mm -hmm. Nobody wants to do that anymore. No. Yeah. You know, as a nurse, I used to run around the floor, and I'm like running around doing everything for everybody else, and I'm just like, what am I really getting out of this? Right. Mm -hmm. Other than the fact that I loved helping my patients. <laughs> right. <laughs> that's what I loved about it. So that's what I love about this. Yeah. Is that I actually still get to take care of people, and I get to hear those things who say, thank you for changing my life. Right. Thank you for giving my life back. Right. I play with my kids. I sleep better at night. Right. That's what I loved about it. And that's what yeah. I loved about being a nurse yeah. is that I could see somebody the next month and they're just like, just thank you. Yeah. That okay. goes so far for me. So this reminds me, and Carmel, you'll probably agree. And so will you, Blair. Um, when we started, we were selling jewelry. I also looked at es selling essential oils. I looked at this other company that had uh, house cleaning products. I looked at you know various different opportunities. But guess what? When I went to their fan pages, I did not see life changing stories. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There was nobody talking about That's how incredibly their life changed because they changed the cleaning products under their kitchen sink. There is no story on the fan page saying how incredibly their life changed because of the jewelry that they put on that day. No, right? you only have one body. I mean, That's it. yeah. So the fact That's that we have a product that can physically change mm -hmm. the way that you feel mm -hmm. and all you need to do is look at our fan page read the stories, follow the people who represent the product, mm -hmm. see how their lives have improved, how you can see the physical change in their photos, you can see the happiness, you can see the calm, because the product, you can't buy it anywhere else, mm -mm. You know, mm -mm. right? Like I could go to Target, I could go to Amazon, I can buy mm -hmm. my cleaning products there, I could buy my jewelry, yep. uh, like at Nordstrom, you cannot buy Thrive anywhere else. And be loud and proud, I mean like mm -hmm. wear it, Show it, share it, yeah. the whole nine yards. Because 100%. when I started it, nobody knew I was doing it. Mm. None of my nurses, none of my right. doctors. But they could see a physical change. But they did. They said, what is, yeah. what's different mm -hmm. about you? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, that. Okay, so speaking about different, there's one more thing before we get off today that I want to make sure we hit, which is auto shifts. Like, Carmel, what oh. makes us different with auto shifts? Because <laughs> some people that. have been on auto shifts before in the past. And like literally have to cancel credit cards. Raise yes. your hand yes. if you had Can't a hard get time out of it. Uh -huh. <laughs> getting out of an auto so shift. Talk a little bit about that. And I gotta go change somebody's life. So I gotta that go. is hundred percent. Okay, so with Lavelle, it's super easy. Literally, it's like logging into your Facebook, logging into your Amazon account, and pushing a button. Yeah. Or walking I will into a grocery you. store and buying right. what you want when you want. Right. Yeah. There is one that I'm specifically thinking about because I had to go through hoops. Yes. To, to cancel. It. Cancel. Yeah. Like they, I think they're trying to work on a cloud, like a system where you can chat with them. And it literally said, sorry for the inconvenience, but we're still working on our system. And it literally took a full week for someone to get back to me. Meanwhile, was, the auto ship process. Right, exactly. Like, <laughs> I don't well, want no, it. I, I <laughs> so you cancel your credit card because you can't get out of right. it otherwise. That's the only way, only way. Yeah, that mm -hmm. I have figured out. Like, it's so hard to get out of auto ships. And I know that when we get new customers, mm -hmm. they panic. Right, because, because of this. They've been on the isogenic yes. auto ship that sucked. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, one of the ones that stands out in my mind, do you remember the Honest Company? Yeah. And they started yes, yes. out as an auto ship. Yeah. They're not direct sales, but they're an example of someone who did auto yeah. ship. And they, oh my gosh, I would call and call and call and sit and sit and sit on the line mm -hmm. to try and get through to somebody so that I could say, I need to cancel or pause. Mm -hmm. With technology, Finally, I have to be that easy. Now, did you ask the same question I did? So when I came, whenever, um, 
I was approached or Kelly approached. Yeah. I had like a ton, like I had like 15 questions. Yes. And the first thing was auto ships. Auto shipments. Yes. I'm like, same here. How many times am I going to have things taken out that I don't want to come out? She's like, you right. have control over that. And I'm like, there's a catch. Yeah. There's a catch. And she's right. like, no, you get to control that 100%. And I was yeah. like, oh. And which wow. company is Love it, that. you guys? That would, that would be Isogenics for me as okay. far as that. And, and. Yeah. Because I was a promoter of that. And I'm yep. just going to put it out there. Okay. I didn't get paid unless I ordered whether I needed something or not. Ooh, I know an essential oil company that does that. So, for <laughs> me, that was tough, y'all. There was a lot of times I didn't need anything. Right. But I knew that I wasn't going to get paid unless I bought a That's certain amount. Crazy. And I was like, I'm out. Yeah. I can't do okay, this. Okay, so, and here's another thing, you all. Did you, first of all, who watching has struggled with getting off of an auto ship? I mean, come on. Okay. <laughs> also, did you all know with Thrive... And I'm sure there's probably other companies out there, but you'd have to probably dig long and hard to find mm -hmm. them. But with the Thrive Experience, you log into your account and you get yourself set up on an auto ship or not. It's up to you. Right. And if um, you're earning an income because you're growing a business, this is the coolest thing. You are qualified to be paid mm -hmm. one of three ways. Okay. You are True. paid one of three ways. Or not paid, but qualified to be paid. Mm -hmm. Like she was saying, if you didn't order on auto ship, boom, you're out, you get no commissions. I got nothing. Company keeps it, maybe it rolled up, I don't know. Usually the company has No, 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 I got nothing. But but who got <sighs> commissions there? Somebody did, right? Yeah. <laughs> and it was the ones at the top. Okay. <laughs> it wasn't the off one off who got me in there. It was the ones at the top. <laughs> oh, and uh, yeah, okay, 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 okay. I'm serious. <laughs> this is where I'm going with this, uh -huh. you guys. Get ready for the mic uh -huh. drop here. So this is the thing about the auto ship situation, right? And if any of you know people that have made big money in network marketing companies that require an auto ship to be paid, they probably have a huge inventory because they keep ordering and ordering and ordering, otherwise they don't get paid, mm -hmm. right? And um, so one thing that I, I absolutely love about what we have in our company, and like I said, maybe there's another company that does this, I don't know, let me know if you find one. Um, mm -hmm. We can be paid, qualified to be paid, if we have our own order over 100 bucks, if we use our credits. Mm -hmm. And by the way, Lavelle does not charge you to use your credits. Did you nope. know that other companies do? What? Mm -hmm. <laughs> they charge you to use your credits to get your free product. Um, hello, that's another way they're making money off of you. Mm -hmm. um, and then, then you can also be qualified to be paid those commissions if you have a, your customers that order. And now here's mm -hmm. a cool thing too, you may or may not know about Lavelle, and take a look at whatever company it is you're gonna be part of, because this is a key to their um, integrity, I think, mm -hmm. is are they mainly a customer acquisition model, right? Mm -hmm. We were talking about our numbers, so we're at about, we're at 700,000 customer accounts in Rob and my network, and we're at 70,000 qualified and active promoters in our network. That's about 10%, right? Mm -hmm. Now overall in the company we're also at 10% we have 10 million customers we've got a million promoters mm -hmm. and so about 10% so take a peek at whatever that company is that, that you might be considering and mm -hmm. make sure that they are a customer acquisition model because if they are then that will be a sign that they probably ha are people are building their business with integrity they're not cheating the system yep. anytime here's my belief anytime that you're involved with something that you get out of integrity and you cheat the compensation plan so that you can get paid you eventually will self implode because people don't like to live their lives out of integrity people they may not consciously know this or say this but eventually lie after lie you'll get caught in it and you'll self implode and i see it again and again mm -hmm. which is why i left which is why she left yeah yeah yeah, yeah. i yeah. mean and, and you can't put your head on your pillow at night right you need it it's not right mm -hmm. no it's 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 not anyway we've got a lot of collective experience here in the industry so if you have questions drop a comment below Absolutely. if you've enjoyed this video it's really we've hit some key points we usually don't get this aggressive mm -mm. But I'll tell you what, when we're sitting around last night and some people in the room had not had any prior experience in network marketing mm -hmm. or direct sales, and then they were hearing our worst stories. You see me either. I mean, I came from, I mean, I was a nurse. You know, I don't, yeah. I don't sell anything. Right. That's what I love about this. It's about 
caring and loving and sharing and helping people. Mm -hmm. Had nothing to do about patting my pocket or anything like that. That's what I loved about right. it. I'm like, I can still do what I love and enjoy mm -hmm. and not go home and tired and miss my kids or have to have my mom pick them up or go, where did the time go? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I love that about it. Yes. Mm -hmm. And the fact that I get to do these kind of things and actually get to truly grow. Right myself instead of being told when I can go to the bathroom or when I can eat right. or if I eat at all or anything like no. y'all that's tiring <laughs> yeah, so I love I love the fact that we're just we are who we are yep and if anybody reaches out to you it's because we genuinely love and care about you and know what it's going to do for you absolutely 100% well and we wrote down a couple of points because we had as I said we were sitting around chatting <laughs> and the girls that had not been in another company were like you guys need to go live mm -hmm. you need to share these experiences because people just don't get it mm -hmm. and that reminds me one of the things that we missed remember when we did the jewelry how many people earned our trips very few like a couple hundred I never earned any you didn't no I and I've earned every trip that's been available, which will be my fourteenth one, fourteenth in the end of February. In less I have earned every one since I've been into. Yeah. Yep. In less than five years. Like in Stella, that was too challenging. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. And and say it. Car. Our cars. So here's the thing, like with waiting room, <laughs> like going back to waiting room oh. and helping someone achieve mm -hmm. a car. That's what we get to do. <laughs> we get to help them by moving a new promoter to somebody else so right. that they can hit that rank and eliminate the second largest household debt mm -hmm. in the family home. Mm -hmm. And how many times have we heard people say, I needed a new car, yeah, but I didn't know how I was going to get one. Yeah, yeah. me too. <laughs> I mean, y'all, seriously, like that's, that's the stories that I love. They're like, I'm driving a car, A, I would never have, but B, I was like trying to find a friend to get me to work or do what I need to right. do because I needed a car but I didn't have the income to get a new car. And I didn't, like, it's just, those are the stories that I love. They're like, so two points on that. I love that. <laughs> two points love on it. that is you can have two car bonus owners in the family. Absolutely. Most of these companies out there, you can only have one. Oh. Only have one business built in the family. So the, the, the couple, both of them wouldn't actually be able to be building their own team mm -hmm. with their own income. So both Rob and I have become millionaires as a result of building our own businesses. Mm -hmm. Also, we both have our own car bonuses. Also, mm -hmm. <laughs> like on and on, guess what? You guys, you guys, do you understand this? Like who, who on here watching has earned their car bonus? Like let's just drop a comment there. Absolutely. Um, Shout out to you guys, because here's what I want you to understand. In many of these companies, these other companies, we aren't naming the direct names right now, but let me just tell you, they have to have a hundred to $125,000 in volume on their team to earn their car. How much do we have to have in volume on our team per month to earn our car? 12,000. 12, I mean, 12,000, you guys. 31 days for me. This company Crazy. so heavily rewards our newest people. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so she earned it in 31 days. Three, three months. Three months. Me, 18 days. My husband was, I think, two months. I don't know. I can't remember. But my point is, like, it is, this company mm -hmm. rewards the newest people. It's not just the top leaders that make money. It's not just the top mm -hmm. leaders that get to pay off that mm -hmm. debt. We're it all is equal. Everybody. We're all working equal. together. Yes. Doesn't mm -hmm. matter what your rank are. Mm -hmm. We love you. And we yeah. want the same for everybody. Exactly. Right. So this has been a fun little video here to do with you all. We've covered so many points. Um, for those of you who have watched until the end, please uh, drop a comment and say, I watched the whole thing. Yeah. Or type replay, replay if you catch the replay later. And let us know, like, what are you most excited about about your business? We want or to maybe you were that one that's like, I needed to hear this as validation to pick yeah. up that phone to reach back out to the person who who's already this? reached out to the you yeah. about this. The person who shares this video with you. So if mm -hmm. any of you are looking, you're like, you're like, this video is so great. You're not on our team. We don't care. Share the video with your friends. Absolutely. And if they ever reached out to us, we refer them back to you. We're not going to take your people because nope. guess what? We don't need to. We've mm -hmm. got so many prospects coming in to us that we don't need to. There's no, no. poaching. No. That's the other no. thing. No. No poaching. Like we don't poach no. other people's mm -mm. reps. Why no. would we? Mm -mm. We will 100% we say... To. Who did you? Yes. Who, who, who did you talk to? Yes. You're going back to them, right? And we send them right. Or on who back. sent you to this fan page, Lavelle yep. fan page? Yep. Go back to them. Send them find right them. on back. We don't no. poach because that would be out of integrity, and who wants to live with that? 
once you go down the path of lies, it's a dark road. Yes. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yes. Okay, thanks for tuning in. Love it. Love you all. Love Any you. closing thoughts? No, thanks for hopping no. on. Yes. <laughs> this we is enjoyed just it. spoken truly from the heart and us being completely candid. transparent <laughs> and candid. Yeah. <laughs> Basically. Genuine while we're all still here. Yes. Yeah. Oh, Absolutely. and not going anywhere. No. 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 Mm-mm. Love you guys. Love you. Bye. Have a great day. <laughs> Bye-bye. Bye.